Why are you here? I heard that Mr. Mo was in a bad mood. As a former secretary of yours, I should come back to check on you. You still have a conscience. Have you thought it over? Work for me. Be the CAO in my company. I don't plan to change jobs within three months. All right, then. Since you're not coming, I'll help you with your work. Hello? Mr. Zhang? Get me a villa in the suburbs. The kind that is suitable for vacation. Count it as Chao Hua's work. Yeah, okay. Mr. Yin, just leave it to me. Okay. Then I... Something went wrong with the project. Mr. Yin, you can go to work. I'll take care of myself. I'll come see you when I'm free. Hmm, okay. Room 102 there. Hello, I'll pay the bill. Okay. Oh, miss, your bill has already been paid. Huh? Here. Hmm. Mr. Mo, Miss Chow's medical bills have been paid. Si Chung, Li Yun and I are going back. You can start to prepare the wedding. It's yours. Mr. Zhang, how come I didn't see the order yesterday on the performance report? Sun Meng helped you do a lot of work yesterday. She went through all the procedures. This order will be Sun Meng's. You think it's appropriate? Listen to me, Chao Hua. We're all colleagues. It's just a small order. Don't make a fuss about it. I haven't investigated who harmed me, but that order was my contribution. How could you steal it from me? Chao Hua, you'd better know who you are. How dare you talk to her like that? You didn't do any work but want the commission? In your dreams. Mr. Zhang, that's quite impressive. I can't believe you were so rude to Mr. Mo's principal secretary. Secretary Zhao, why are you here? If I hadn't come in person, how could I know Mr. Zhang is bullying his subordinate? Ah, please. You got me wrong. Chao Hua, you are so silly. Why did you resign and come to such a place? The environment helps me change the mood. Mr. Mo can't live without you at all. He flew into a rage in the company today. We couldn't handle it at all. What's the reason? Something went wrong with that piece of land. Chao Hua, come back to the company with me. OK, I'll go back with you. Let's go. I thought I said, not to bother me. Get out of here. I went a long way and bought your favorite green bean cake and a cup of freshly brewed coffee with milk and sugar. Would you like to try it? Why are you here? I heard that Mr. Mo was in a bad mood. As a former secretary of yours, I should come back to check on you. You still have a conscience. You still didn't forget to tease me. The land in the East was settled long ago, right? How could it go wrong? We've come to an arrangement, but Zhou Jiande, that old guy, would rather pay liquidated damages than sign it. Perhaps it's not because of Mr. Zhou. Mrs. Zhou doesn't want to sell it. Why is that? It's said that Mrs. Zhou spent her childhood on that piece of land. Mr. Zhou is a henpecked husband, so I think we should take Mrs. Zhou as the point of departure. You haven't forgotten what I taught you. How's it, Chao Hua? Right, there's something about Mr. Mo that you must be aware of. The most important point, he's allergic to peaches. A little peach juice can make him faint. Hello, Mom. Dear, I miss you so much. You're alone in Northville. How are you doing? Mom, I'm doing fine. Take care of yourself. These days, I'm always worried about you. I'm worried you'll suffer in that city. Mom, I'm really fine. I'll see you in a few days. Go to bed early. OK, OK.
Chao Hua, are you free tomorrow? I'll take you to East Garden Resort. I wonder if it can help you get more clients. East Garden Resort? I remember the Mo Group invested in it. Okay, I'm free. Thank you. Mom, rest assured, I'll surely give you a better life. Hey, Mr. Deng, have another drink. Mr. Deng, don't just drink with her. Come on, you two bad girls. Dongjihao. Mr. Yin, huh? This is too much. We've been waiting for a long time. Whoa, Mr. Yin, aren't you afraid that Miss Mo will be jealous? Yo, Mr. Yin, where did you get such a beauty? Let me introduce her, Chao Hua. Hello, guys. I'm a friend of Mr. Yin. Chao Hua. Hey. Hey, hey, take a seat. Sit down. Hey. You remember me? You are... Think hard. Me. Dong <laughs> Zihao. Hey, in junior high school, you sat in front of me. Oh, that's that dark-skinned fat boy. So you're childhood sweetheart. Don't make fun of us. Annoying. Hey, don't you want to swim? Hurry and change your clothes. Hey, Mr. Dung, we're all going to get changed. How about we take Miss Chow with us? Okay, go, hurry. Let's go, Miss Chow. Miss Chow, how did you hook up with Mr. Yin? Tell us. Right. Any tricks? Please teach us. I knew him a long time ago. Just stop pretending. You rely on your body just like us. I really hate women like her. As for that part, just do it in this way. Help! Chao Hua! How did you fall into the water? Mr. Yin. You must be careful. Don't catch a cold. I'm fine. Are you alright? Since you're okay, how much longer will you stay in the arms of my sister's fiancé? Isn't it shameful? Go get changed. Chi Cheng, don't be so rude. Hey, hey, are you blind or what? Didn't you see someone pushed her into the water? Uh, well, you two, come here. Hurry up! Over there. Stand still, stand still. Yeah. Oh my. You must be careful. I said, they must be extra careful. Thank you. Let's go. I'll take you to get changed. Are you okay? I'm fine. I just think I'm a wet blanket and caused you trouble. What trouble could there be? Mr. Yin, we need to keep our distance. Otherwise, Miss Mo will be angry. You take a rest. I'm going out. Chao Hua, are you in there, Chao Hua? Bad news. Something happened to Mr. Mo.